and hundreds of activists on Saturday stormed the streets of Lagos to protest alleged underground moves by some desperate opposition figures in Kogi State as well as other perceived political enemies to unleash terror on the remedied past governor of Kogi State, Yahaya Bello. The activists who addressed a press conference and staged a huge rally condemned calls by a group called Zero Corruption Agenda in collaboration with another group, Kogites United Against Corruption for the EFCC to ignore court orders. Many Nigerians already suspect that the endless reckless attack on the former governor, his family member, and even innocent children by EFCC is most unprofessional way. Despite revelation that shows that he was actually protected by the law, have the political undertones. But the desperation by some opposition figures and Yaya Bello politician enemies, politics, political enemy, to hide under the purported fight against corruption, to call for the arrest of a man who has a court order for his fundamental human rights to be protected, and who is already in court with the EFCC almost confirmed is insinuations of an evil plan against him by some interested politicians using the EFCC platform. This is not to detect. This is not difficult to detect. Having seen the composition of the so-called co-guides, who made this curious call even in London, the video exposed their ethnic living, leaning as they were speaking the language of the aggrieved politicians of Kogi State. The courts are, are there to mediate between the government and the citizens, and between two or more contending interests. And the, the court's intervention is sacrosanct until overturned by a superior court.